Good evening everyone and welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be deep diving into contouring. I've never done it before, don't really want to. This might be a fail, might be a flop, or it might be good. I don't know, but we're going to find out. Okay, so we're back. And yes, I did say evening because I'm recording this at 11.49 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But besides that, I want to know, guys, have you been your beautiful selves today? Hmm. I, I have been kind of, I've been really lazy today. But that's besides the point, so we're going to contour today, I've looked up how to do it, we're going to attempt it, it might be bad, but we're going to find out. So the first thing we have to do is prime our face. So we're going to be using the same primer that I used in the last video, so we're just going to go ahead and... Okay, so I just put on our primer, it's all set. Hope you like the little snapping thing here. Trying to speed up this process so we can just get straight to contouring. Today we'll be using the Cole Lab Foundation. Since I know a little bit more about makeup, we're gonna give this foundation a shot. This is the one that Sally Beauty Supply was all like, hey, this is your shade. So really quickly, we're just gonna go ahead and snap into that foundation. Okay, so the foundation is on and I look like a ghost. This is not funny. So, I guess I was really right when I said, yeah, they really didn't know, like, yeah, no, I'm so pale. But now, the next step is our concealer. So we're just gonna go ahead and snap into that. Okay, so the concealer is on now and I'm looking like a ghost that died again, so I'm even more white. But we're going to go ahead and get our setting powder here. We're gonna, again, we're gonna use the translucent and the HD sheer powder. And we're gonna go ahead and snap into that. Okay, so everything is set. We are ready to go for the contour now. I had to put lipstick on because I looked like death was coming to get me. So I need like a hint of color to be like, please, please don't take me. But you're already, no, please. You get the gist, okay? If you guys follow me on my Instagram, you would have already seen me post this on there being like, hey guys, I'm doing it. Am I good at it? No. Have I tried it? No. Is this potentially going to be a disaster? Yes. If I can just... You know what? Everyone makes this look so easy, you know? How they get the packaging open. Look, I literally just broke that. Here's it open. It's beautiful. It is the e.l.f. Cosmetics Contour of Light Medium. It's actually, like, heavy. It has a mirror in it. Guys, it has a mirror in it. Oh, let me see. Light side, which I guess is gonna be this side right here. Um, so this color is where you want to send things out. So here, definitely here. I got that big double chin and maybe my forehead. Cause I got a four head. Haha. <laughs> I'll see myself out. This is the brush that we're going to be using for the uh, thinning one. The darker shade to bring in or at least give us a little look of thinness. Because I ain't thin, y'all. <laughs> so we're just going to go in here. Not really sure how much I'm supposed to have on there. We're just going to do that. Are you guys seeing anything? Cause I don't know if I am. I think I need to go harder. Ooh, 
Oh my god, do you see that? It's working. This is crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. So I definitely want to get down here and maybe here. So let me do that really quickly because this looks crazy. Okay, so tell me guys if you are seeing a difference here. I can kind of see where it's just like bringing everything in into like a point. Get rid of that, you know, pesky little double chin that I got there, you know? Now that I got the slimming dark parts sort of done, um, we're gonna go in here and we're going to attempt to highlight up here, boop at the nose right here, and our chin because we want those areas to stand out. And apparently, it helps with the slimming effect. We're gonna try it. It's my first time attempting to contour, so it's probably already a fail, but that's okay. We're learning, and that's what it's all about. <laughs> Can you guys actually see that? Hold on. Oh. Oh, I guess you can really see that. Ooh. Okay, so I have everything on now, and we're just supposed to like blend it and buff it out, so let me get to that really quickly. Guys, I almost forgot. They want you to contour your nose too, so let me do that really quickly. <laughs> okay, so she is all done. Contour and all. This, I gotta say, was pretty interesting to do and I can definitely tell looking at the phone recording because I'm switching up my recording here trying to get something a little bit better. I feel like this is a lot better. Um, I can already see like it tucked this in. My cheekbones are actually like way more noticeable and you can like see my entire like cheek move right here because it's drawing your attention here and that is so cool. Makeup is so 
cool. It's just another form of beauty. But you are beauty itself. You, the person, you are beautiful. Um, so I'm going to take this off the tripod, get a little bit closer, and see how we feel about it. Okay, so we're back. So we are a little bit closer. This is what it is looking like. And wow, it is... And that is a spicy meatball that we got there. Hmm. This stuff is really cool, really awesome. Again, I've never contoured anything before, so I don't know if this is like the bottom of the barrel, if it's like the creme de la creme. Hmm. Uh, but anyways, this was a lot of fun, and I can definitely tell where it's like taken in my chin area, which is great, because y'all know me. I got that awesome, hold on, there we go, I got that awesome double chin action going on and it's really cool that I can literally blend and buff that away, but anyways, let's see if I can do this, but anyways, I hope you guys have a great morning, evening, afternoon, and night wherever you are in the world, and I will see you, and I will talk to you in the next video. Bye! <laughs>